Hello, and welcome to the Distance Learning Institute Blackboard training video series. Today we will be showing you how to attach a PDF document in Blackboard. PDFs are a great way to share reading materials with your students. In today's video, I'm going to go ahead and attach a PDF under my Readings Multimedia tab. In order to do that, you must first click on the drop down menu and scroll to edit. Once you do that, it's going to open up a separate window. There's a couple ways that you can attach a PDF. First one being is I'm going to go ahead and attach one to an existing one that I already created right underneath it. And then I'm going to name my document. It's called UDL Engagement. Once I do that, I'm going to highlight the text and I'm going to copy it. Once I do that, I'm going to scroll to the toolbars at the top and click on Insert File. It's going to bring up this separate window here where I could browse my computer for the file that I want to attach. I could browse content collection. I could browse the cloud storage or go to a source URL. I'm going to go ahead and simply drag and drop mine because I know it's located on the desktop. You'll notice that it turns purple. It means that your file is being accepted. Once you do that, you're going to see the name of link to file. I'm going to go ahead and highlight that and I'm going to paste the name of my document. UDL engagement. I'm going to scroll down and hit submit and then you're going to click on submit again. You'll notice that your text turns blue and it's underlined meaning that your file has been attached. You can simply hit submit at this point and your document will be attached. I'm going to show you a second way you can also attach a PDF file while we're in this browser. Under attachments you could click on browse my computer, browse content collection, and browse iCloud storage as well and then you can attach your file. I'm going to go ahead and drag and drop my file. It will automatically be named because I named the file previously. If you scroll down you could permit viewers to view this content by clicking on yes or no. You can track the number of views and you can select the time to display it and display it until and then it'll close off. At this point I'm going to go ahead and click submit. Once I do that, it's going to take me back to my page in Blackboard, and you're going to notice under my Readings Multimedia tab, I have my UDL engagement under Attachments. That's when I dragged and dropped it, and it also has it in the UDL engagement, the one that I typed out. Once you click on it, it's going to open up the, the PDF in a separate file. Same thing is going to go with the attachment that I put at the top. I click on it, it'll open a separate window as well. These are two different ways that you can attach PDFs, whether you want to put it in a listing and bullet point, or if you just simply want to just drag and drop it, they'll both be able to be accessed the same way. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe to our channel to see other helpful videos about Blackboard and online learning.